Yo, what's going on people? It's your boy Ape Poncho, back at you again with another video. So, if you guys didn't know, tonight the Premier League finally kicks back off again, with Aston Villa going head-to-head -head with Sheffield United, and Arsenal going up against Man City. Now, of course, the coronavirus pandemic took the world by storm, and this caused all sporting events to be called off. But recently, we've seen the likes of the UFC and the WWE now hold events in where no audience is there to watch, but they will allow it to be televised again with little to none people actually in the the stadium. So I stumbled across this article which I thought would be interesting to share with you guys and that is Versus which I believe is a sporting blog and they had reported that the Premier League could play quote unquote walk on music for subs coming onto the pitch. Now the article does go on about how shirts will receive Black Lives Matter and NHS badges due to the recent events with the protests and the NHS responding to the coronavirus pandemic but for the sake of the video I'll just be mentioning the music part but I will leave the article linked down in the description if you guys want to go ahead and read the whole thing. So the article reads, with all games taking place in empty grounds, top flight chiefs have allowed the move to offer some advantage to the hosts, with results in the Bundesliga favouring away sides more than home teams so far. Clubs are allowed to play music at key moments, including after goals and for subs, with players allowed to have individual music as part of goal celebrations. This means we could potentially see Moise Keane coming off the bench during the Merseyside derby while soundtracked to Gunner. Todd Cantwell wheeling away in celebration as Young Thug surf rings out at Carrow Road, or Heady One gets blasted out at the bridge after Tammy Abraham bags another Premier League goal. So yes, it is a potential that UK draw music, just like it says in the title of this video, could well be getting played at a Premier League match near you. Now we know how clued up football players are when it comes to UK draw music, because let's face it, the way these younger players are involved with social media nowadays, and of course the majority of draw rappers influence being online, we know that a lot of them know each other personally. Also, sports people and draw rappers have linked up at sponsored events, and just simply because the fact of how big UK draw has become, especially here in the UK, it wouldn't surprise me that one of them decides to put a draw song on, because even one example of draw having influence on the field is when Jesse Lingard did a gun lean as a celebration to one of his goals. But right now, this is only in place for the Bundesliga, and it's not confirmed for the Premier League, but it wouldn't surprise me if they follow soon, so keep an eye out for that one. But moving on to our next story, and that is CB has a plugged in with Fumes the Engineer dropping tonight at 8 p.m. Don't know, it's your boy CB, King of Drill, in jail, on broad. Anyway, you get me? Man, know the thing. Gaza, is up, G's up. Right now you're plugged in to Fumes the Engineer. So as the majority of you will know, CB is currently serving a 23-year jail sentence, which I have covered in depth in the throwback case, which I will leave linked down in the description. So feel free to go and check that out. But with the Plugged In series, of course, only being a recent release, and I'm guessing it's only recently been recorded, it's safe to say that it's not CB in the video for you people wondering, and it's definitely some kind of actor, more than likely somebody that he knows. So I did see some comments flying about that CB has a lot of unreleased music and it got me thinking. So I don't know if you guys are familiar with Vibes Cartel, the dancehall artist, but he's currently serving a lengthy jail sentence. Now, he's denied claims that he records music from inside prison, but either way, he definitely doesn't star in his music videos, but there has been multiple videos shot with lookalikes of him. Now, using that same formula, I definitely think that CB and even with the likes of SJ from OFB should go down this route if they are going to release music rather than an animated or lyric video because it gives the viewer a more immersive feel to the video if they was going to go about doing it that way, especially if they have a massive catalogue of music that hasn't been released. And as well, Vibes Cartel has been locked up for many years now, and granted he's a superstar worldwide, but he has been able to maintain his relevancy with music dropping all the time, and again having lookalike star in his music videos has really helped him again to stay relevant over the years. But yeah, this is just a little quick one, but let me know what you guys think of this in the comment section below. I want to know your guys' thoughts. Do you think moving forward, artists like CB and SJ and other people that have been locked up for many years, do you feel like they should get people to come in and act if they were them to make it a more immersive feel to the video? Because because let's just use SJ for a quick example. Imagine him, Double L's and Bando K in a video. It's not actually SJ, but it's someone who could act out like SJ. I'm pretty sure the video is going to get a lot more views on it if this was the case, but that is just my opinion. And again, I want to know what you guys think about that. Give the video a little like, and if you want the latest drill, street and music news out of the uk be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell it's been your boy a poncho and i'm out